This Torah class is brought to you by TorahAnytime.com We know Tu B'Shvat has some yomtiv quality to it. The Shulchan Aruch says that on Tu B'Shvat we don't recite Tachnon. And the question is, how is Tu B'Shvat a yomtiv? What is the yomtiv element of Tu B'Shvat? It seems like merely a, a halachic date, a line of demarcation, when the first year for Hilchos Meister is up and the new year begins, that you don't take Meiser from one year's crop onto another, and the line of demarcation is Tu B'Shvat, when the sap begins to rise in the tree. But what exactly is the joyous Yom Tov aspect of Tu B'Shvat? The Kloisenberg Rebbe, Zechat Sag Devrach, has an amazing Cheshvan, giving us a wondrous insight into the greatness of the day of Tu B'Shvat. We know there is Machloikes Tanoam as to when the world was created. Rebbe Lezer is of the opinion the world was created in Tishrei, and Rebbe Yeshua is of the opinion the world was created in Nisan. Likewise, says Gemara Rosh Hashanah, Dafir Aleph, they argue as to when the redemption will occur. Rebbe Lezer holds, Be Tishrei Nivra Ha'olam, Uve Tishrei Asidin Ligal. Rebbe Lezer holds, the world was created in Tishrei. Yes, the first time around, God redeemed us in Nisan, but However, Rabbi Yeshua disagrees. Rabbi Yeshua is of the opinion. In Nisan we were redeemed. In Nisan we, were, we are destined to be redeemed. Well, says the Kleisenberg Rebbe, if in Nisan we're destined to be redeemed, the same way if the world was created in Nisan, that's when man was created. But the first day of creation, the day that God said, let there be light, is Chaf He Adar. Likewise, the redemption process will begin Chaf He Adar. So really, the beginning of the redemption will be the 25th day of Adar. Now, there's a concept that before the Rebbe Shem brings something to fruition, he conceives of the idea 40 days prior, as the Gemara tells us, Four days before a child is born, uh, before a child is created in utero, the heavenly voice proclaims the daughter of Pliny to Pliny. So if the beginning of the Gula process is on the 25th day of Adar, when does God conceive of the idea of redemption? 40 days earlier, Tu B'Shvat! Tu B'Shvat is the day that it arises in the mind, the Kiviyachal of the Rebbe Hashem, to redeem Klal Yisrael. Hence, Tu B'Shvat is a Yom Tif, because it is the day of the conception of the Gula. May we be Zaycha on this Tu B'Shvat. It should be Oyla, it should arise in the mind of HaKadosh Baruch Hu to redeem us, to bring us back to Eretz Yisrael, to bring Mashiach Tzidkenu Vimher V'yameinu Amen. Afrei Lechem Lechtegen Tu B'Shvat. You've just experienced another Torah class brought to you by TorahAnytime.com.